you have to kind of change the mindset of thinking that in the NHD you're working. It is a job and you're working, but really it's about learning. So it's not that you're getting paid to work, you're getting paid to learn, which is quite a unique uh, environment, right? You typically have to pay <laughs> for a course, but here you're getting paid to learn, so. And PhD and an NHD program um, are different. Of course, there are also similarities. They follow after uh, completion of a master program. And from then on, we have uh, different paths. I definitely had my debate between choosing an NGD or a PhD. Uh, in the end, I went for an NGD because I was, at that time, and, and I still am happy I made the choice, I wanted a more uh, practical type of program. But with an NGD, you, you still answer some questions, but it's more about uh, building a, a, a practical application and developing a, a solution, um, but still within an academic setting, right? I felt like I would like to do some practical things to really get myself, my hands dirty. Uh, I would like to make some like, visible contributions, really help with, help with some people with their like, challenges. I decided to go for it because I wanted to deepen my knowledge. I wanted to keep uh, studying, keep learning. Um, and uh, I saw this as a very good opportunity because it was a combination between both worlds, academy and uh, industry, so to say. <laughs>